Today, me and my friend Connor will be starting a new series in Theme Park Tycoon 2. But before we get into the video, make sure to like and subscribe with the notification bell turned on. But without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So, we are here, right? We're doing a brand new series, I'm the Connor, and we're yes. doing Theme Park Tycoon. So, if you haven't heard of this game, and we're going to be building a park from scratch. As you can see, we've already done a path, which looks quite nice. Connor did this, so we're going to get straight into it. So today, this episode is going to be about the um, entrance. So we're going to do the entrance, and then we'll work it out from there. So we need to think of a style. What style are you thinking? Well, it could do pretty much anything for the entrance, couldn't we? You kind yeah. of kind of comes a bit later on. I mean, you need some kind of thing to follow up of at the beginning. Yeah. So, we could do anything. We could do classic kind of wooden building, but I don't really think that goes well with this floor. First of all, I'm going to get rid of this uh, ugly archway, which actually looks ugly. There we go, that's better. See how it's much better it looks if it's open, so it's that ugly arch. Um... We could, because we can't really survive off 100 grand, 150 grand, so we could make a little money farm first. If I start, if I work on a money farm, you can try to brainstorm an idea Yeah. for an entrance. Um, oh, I'll do the money farm underground. Okay. Which just makes the job extremely difficult for me, so I don't know so why. I'm kind of thinking... A nice little kind of, um, like an olden kind of, um, you know, like back in the um, 1800s where they had like the pebble stone, pebble, um, cobblestone roads with like the um, kind of old buildings. We could go like that as well. So I'm going to scratch up a little idea here. Okay, I'm going for kind of the Victorian style here. Like a thatched roof. With like kind of a, a yellow kind of like wooden beams in between. Yeah, I think that should look pretty cool. And then there will be the entrance where people walk through. So I'm just going to catch you when I'm kind of got a nice little, nice coloured concrete. Okay, I've got some nice little yellow. I've painted this concrete yellow. And... Mm, um, maybe I should put on, normally Victorian houses are white, aren't they? Kind of whitish. I'll go for a nice grey here. Do you not have the Operations Game Pass? Operations Game Pass? No, I don't think so. Oh my god, it's gonna make it like my worst nightmare to do roller coasters. <laughs> Why are you making a train? Because it's taking about half a decade to walk over there. Bit yeah, quicker I can get them, the more money we make. Oh, I only, only got 77 grand. What have you been doing? I'd rather have a train length of one and have two trains. A few moments later. Okay, right, I'm starting this Victorian kind of thing and I'm putting some poles in here, as you can see, Connor. And we're yeah, starting to. Yeah. And we kind of, I'm putting some poles in here to make it kind of look more Victorian. We're going for a nice Victorian entrance. And so the customers come through here. And it's going to be cool. I'm going to do this um, part available for NPCs or um, just available for players. What do you think? Uh, I always like it to have NPCs going for it. Okay. It depends. If we want to make it more detailed, then we're better off just going players. Yeah. But... I always like it when NPCs can get through, otherwise I don't really see the point. Yeah. Okay. We'll do it. NPCs can walk around. Because, yeah, I don't see really the point. We're not going to make any money, are we? Nasty thing. Ooh. I've got people riding a corkscrew from 30 quid down to 20. Oh, okay. Oh, we're making compromises. We've gone from 25 to 20. They're riding it. Right, I'm going to see what I can help you with now, then. Um, See how I'm doing, like, quite thick poles on the edges? Yeah. Um, Do kind of, like, thinner poles in the, um, like, in between. 
Yeah, kind of on the insides. Yeah. That would be cool if it kind of like wrapped around. What do you mean? As in like if it came over here a bit more. Maybe. As in like kind yeah. of... Yeah. Maybe we can build apart. like a second building. I might try it. I'm gonna... Yeah. I'm gonna try to build that. Let's, I'll see what happens. Okay. Yeah, kind of go with the same theme as what I'm doing here. I don't know. It, mm, well, I might be able to do it. Okay. It depends if I can get this to build across. I should have probably done this on the other side first. My money farm path is there. Park out of bounds? Oh, what a joke. Just did that entire thing just for it to go that it's out of bounds. Oh, that's, if that says that that's out of bounds. Ooh, is that placed? Yeah, something kind of like that. I mean, I'll change it up in a minute, but just kind of... Yeah, yeah. And then, yeah, maybe you can put, like, one of these pillars, these big pillars, like, at the edge here. Uh, actually, no, you can't. Eh. Well, Why? I guess, because it'll look quite weird. I think you made it pretty hard on yourself already by doing curves, to be honest. And I haven't made this easy either. Great, and neither relative or global is actually going to help me with that. Should be a typical counter on this. Try that. That yeah, yeah. You might be able to do something like that. I well, know. I have to see. I mean, I look weird at the moment, but once kind of get more of it done, it might look a bit better. Yeah. I just did something like that for now. Out of bounds. How is right, okay? Last time I checked, if I'm trying to place here. I think I should be able to place it there. I'm trying to build here on the part boundaries here. Oh, I hate when it does that. The many things that will change. Oh, yes! What right. is that? Okay. I don't know. Slightly further back. Why don't... Uh, oh! Don't know why I did that voice. Victorian. How did you even come up with the idea to do a Victorian park? Well, Victorian um, the uh, cobblestone um, kind of floor, like you know how um, um, in the old like eighteen hundreds it was like um, kind of like cobblestone alleyways with like these Victorian houses. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't do something like this in the floor. What? Yeah, look, like this. Well, ignore ignore this part, but this. So like this, where you kind of got like the rails going through the road, but you can't actually it, see. Yeah, that road. might actually like look kind of like a like an old tram, if you make sense. Yeah, like I tried to do system. the. I'll try to put the path. Uh, no, not the path. The train track slightly higher, so there's a bit more of a gap kind of between the floor and that. But yeah, that might look quite cool. If we figure out like a place to hide the beginning bit where it has to drop down into the floor. Yeah. The odds that windows would like to place nicely on oh, this. Ah, not this. quite. That nice colour. Why the hell have you got it so there's a tr the path going through the train tracks? What, you're talking about my beautiful money farm? Yeah. You should see all the roller coasters. They're all mixed into another. Especially in the first three, like, pre-built roller coasters. <laughs> Imagine if someone's just walking in and suddenly the train just starts going, Ugh. Look, Oh, then it should have looked. If you ask it's me, that's like some kind of bloody level crossing, is it? I can make it. Uh, is it okay? Actually, no, it'll be gone, won't it? Yeah, that was good. Uh, Connor. Kind of like an immersive. Oh, what is this color? Connor's Connor's bringing out his his inner design skills. Well, I'm just gonna see if this looks alright. It'll probably look horrendous. Um. But... Wait, that was easy. Right, for starters, this. that's not happening. That needs to be there to even place. So I've done that wonky already. Right. Uh... Right. So you can't place primitives that you've modified. Because then if I do that, I bet you I won't be able to place. Right. So if you place stuff that's on grid, it won't be out of the park bound. For example, right. this block here I could place. 
But if I then tried to make it thinner so that it wouldn't go through the building, you then couldn't place it. So oh, actually, see. this was completely accidental. But that might look pretty cool, actually. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, if I did, like, I don't know, like, doing, like, Oh, nice wood. Thanks. Yeah, like around the bottom. <laughs> it looks like kind of, kind of some kind of face. Look. Oh, game's being relatively kind today. I see. Slash is actually letting me do that. Um, I'm gonna have to put fences inside the primitives, otherwise they're gonna do their classical. I'm gonna walk straight through the building. Okay. Welcome to 101 Reasons on why popular YouTubers don't make it so that NPCs can go into their park. Could you imagine if you took Benny's park, put actual paths in it, NPCs could walk on? Oh, the amount horrible. of times that they would walk straight through, like, all these primitives and stuff. Yeah. You just <laughs> see all of... I still can't stand it whenever I have precision build mode on like accidentally oh yeah when you then... when you're trying to place um um like uh paths oh god i hate it and you still have precision build mode on so yes yeah, so, like you place paths and it just like does that so you like then you have to cancel the build and you have to go there disable it and then you can start spamming paths it's a nightmare it's, it's always like the worst thing to ever happen oh no, it's just happened to me. <laughs> As we're talking about it. <laughs> I think I've got kind of a design. I don't know if it'll look good, though. I need to add windows in and whatnot first, and then we'll yeah. be able to see. <sighs> so if we just have, like, ordinary windows... Might not even need it in build mode. I feel like if I can get away with not using precision build mode, I will definitely try to. Right, I've added some details. Only issue is, is you can't place these things off grid. Details, alright. So I'm gonna have to. Right, this is the parts that I like doing. I mean, if you look underneath these like flower pots. Like, <laughs> oh yeah. Look under these two. Look insane. Then again, not oh, that anyone's wow. gonna look down there. That's the thing. They look great, and then just like people are just gonna come in and be like, "Oh, nice flower pots." <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not even acknowledge yeah. the flower pots. You can't place that just, off like, grid. You can't up. place those like little fence things off grid. No. Why? Yeah, that's that's an annoying part. Wait, you can't. Oh, unless I use this, will this actually work? Uh oh. Right, I just kind of need to hope that this will work. Otherwise, this will go downhill very quickly. Did that work? I mean, okay. I want the fact that that's really poorly placed. Yeah, we'll just go with that and hope for the best. Oh no, is that is that? It won't paint. Lenny. Why won't it paint? Yeah, so guys, I'm just You can't even place it over each other. What a joke. What are you doing, Connor? I'm trying to figure out these Right, there we go. I had to make like a custom one of the things that are underneath it. Because oh, yeah. you can't place them off grid, so it stick out. Actually, that's really well lined up. I mean, if you literally put yourself right underneath a flower pot, you can see this not lined up. But yeah, I'm out here, which is all that matters. Okay, I expected that to look a lot better. Unless I just do that. No. Okay, we'll just have to deal with that. Wait, and then I can just put this in the corner. So it might be it might be fine. Yeah. Okay, it turned out alright. Slash it could have been worse. Eh, yeah, I don't know. Lenny, what do you think of this? 
Yeah, it looks cool. No, I can just I like see what I can do from there. It looks like I'm making the UK. The flag. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because you got, like, the England. Mm -hmm. I got the second of those strikes there. Okay. That is the end of episode one. <laughs> yeah, right. We'll... I'll ca ooh, catch you guys in episode two. <laughs> Say something, Connor. Hang on, I'm focusing. <laughs> Say goodbye! Nah, hang on. Connor? The windows are priority. No! Say goodbye! Hang on! Just say bloody goodbye! Patience! Stop building the bloody Union Jack and say goodbye! Connor! You'll kill me. Yeah. Connor? Hola! Hang on! <laughs> this is very important stuff, right? Oh wait, that's true, I could have some of them with lights on. A few moments later... Just please say goodbye. Bye! Well, that was the video guys, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like, and subscribe with the notification bell on to see more videos like this. Anyway, goodbye.